do is show you guys how to do uh, this question. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to transfer this to an algebraic expression, and then we're going to simplify. All right. So, first thing, guys, we need to do is we need to determine what are our keywords. All right. What are what's happening to our um, problem? So, automatically looking up here, I say we have it says three times. So therefore, I'm going to use what? I know I'm going to be using multiplication. So I'm not just going to write a multiplication, but I'm going to underline this. So I'm going to multiply three times the sum. The sum tells us to do addition. So what am I going to add? Well, I'm going to add R and D. And then it says squared. So let me go and see this again. So squared is another thing. What a squared means us tells us to do what? Raise it to the second, second power. Very good. Okay. So this is a long sentence. We have three times. So I'm going to multiply three times something. I'll put a dot there. Then it says the sum of r and d squared. So I have to do, I'm going to put parentheses here, r plus d. Does that mean the sum of those two? And then i got to square them too. So it's three times the sum of r and d squared. Right? Then it says minus 2 times, so I'm going to multiply by 2, minus 2 times the sum of r and d squared. So really my problem looks like this. r, because I don't need to write the multiplication symbol. OK? Now. This might be a little confusing, but if you guys can remember, r plus d squared, we don't know what that represents, right? We don't know the value of that. So let's just treat it just like any other um, any other variable that we don't know the value of. So I'm pretty sure most of us could do this. 3x minus 2x equals what? X, right? Yes. What about if x equaled r plus d squared? So if you guys look at this, Really, all I'm doing is, let's pretend r plus d squared equaled x. So really, my final answer is going to be, well, if I have 3 r plus d squareds minus 2 r plus d squareds, I'm only going to be left with 1 r plus d squared. So that is how you first translate an algebraic expression to a, um, I'm sorry, verbal expression to an algebraic. Then you must simplify. Okay. Hit it, girl.